In this quick tip, we're going to see how we can use references inside of Microsoft Word to make it easier for us to build a bibliography. If we're writing for academic writing or for higher education, we need to be able to cite our sources, something like this. Well, if we're doing this, we can use the references and insert citation. This list includes the list of citations already in this document as well as any that were done on this computer. So we keep a list. We don't want to use something in the list. There's add a source and you can walk through the dialogue and add a new source whether it's a book or a journal article or whatever. In this case I want to go ahead and just add one of our existing citations and so I'm going to go right here and I'm going to cite this guy again. And you'll see that it is set up in the format that is expected. And in this case, it's set to a style of APA. We could change that to be MLA. And it will change the way that the citations look. See? So it's changed. I'm going to go ahead and go back to APA. And then I'm going to show you the real power. So you've added these sources. It's put the references in line. What happens when you go to do a bibliography? If I go to the end of this document, I can then insert the bibliography. If I do that, the bibliography gets added complete. Everything that I've already entered gets added to this bibliography. It contains only those items which I have referred to in the text. And so this gives us a quick and easy way to manage our references whenever we're doing any kind of academic writing.